Do you know how to hula hoop? Well, today you don't have to. Good afternoon. My name is Ruby Kapler, and we are going to show you how to make a rug using this hula hoop. And my name is Meyer, and you're not going to need a pencil and paper for this supply list. All you need is scissors, a hula hoop, old or new t-shirts. That's it? Yep, that's all. First, you need to take your t-shirts, match up the bottom hem on each, and cut off each one, as Ruby is doing right now. After doing, the, after doing this, you will need to cut one to one and a half inch strips all the way up to the armpits. This is what they will look like when they're done. You will need to take 11 loops and place them on your hula hoop. Make an X or a cross with all 11 loops. When Fill in the spaces until all 11 loops are on your hula hoop. This will look like bike spokes when done. Now you will be able to start your weaving. Since you use 11 loops when you start with your first loop, you want to combine two of the spokes, so this will make an odd number of spokes to create an over-under effect in your weaving. Take your first loop and make a slip knot on two of the spokes, then you will continue weaving with your loop. To add a loop, all you need to do is start it the same way that you started at the beginning of the project. You will continue to weave, adding loops, until you get approximately 8 inches away from the center. At this time, you will need to split the spokes to treat them as two individual strips instead of a single unit. Weaving over and under each strand instead of going over and under the individual, the doubled spoke. This improves the structure of your project. When the rug is the size you want, tie your last loop to one of the spokes. Cut the loop that is around the hula hoop and tie the ends in pairs. You can then trim them to make fringe or tuck them back into the rug. This will be your finished project. You can use embroidery hoops to make smaller projects, such as pot holders. Now you can put that hula hoop to good use. We got the idea in Family Fun Magazine. You can also get it online at spoonful.com slash craft slash hula hoop rug. We have a copy if you would like one. Any questions? Who would like one? Yes. No. Yes. The question was, do you use any other material than a t-shirt? You can, but we didn't. We used the t-shirt. Any other questions? We got, well, you can use old t-shirts or you can use, or you can get them at Goodwill like we did. It takes three or five to do one rug. Did anyone want one if I didn't get you one? If there's no more questions, this concludes our presentation. Thank you.